Alex, considering some of the reports that have come out today, uh, specifically involving Colby Rasmus, it doesn't sound like you're that enthusiastic about trading one of your outfielders, specifically Colby in this instance. Sure. Um, and I never talk specifically about trading any players uh, from a media standpoint. What I can say is there's a ton of false stuff that gets put out here these four days. As you can imagine, just to try to paint a picture for the fans, um, you've got 30 clubs sitting in a hotel suite 10 hours straight a day and um, you know, a ton of media here that there needs to be stories and rumors and things like that. And it's not to say we don't get asked about, about our players. So I don't want to, I think we've been asked about every single player, but um, I think it's highly, highly unlikely that we trade any of our current position players unless there's something that clearly makes the team better. So to um, skate around the question, but answer the question, I expect our position player core to be on this team. And if anything, we're looking to add to, the, our, to our team, not take away. Do you like your outfield depth within your system at this point? We do. Uh, we can always get better. Um, Sierra right now would kind of be that um, fourth outfield right-handed bat off the bench. And if we can have someone a little more accomplished, a little more established, we'd love to do that. Um, and we have guys like Ghost and Pilar that ideally we'd have those guys in, in the minors continuing to get at bats, but we know defensively they're plus defenders. So um, if we can add a fourth outfielder, a guy to replace a Rajay Davis, for example, uh, we'd look to do that. Um, but otherwise, we like our starting three of Cabrera, Colby, and Batista, and we expect them to be with us on opening day. I get the sense, and I know this was brought up this summer, that uh, Dustin McGowan is going to try to become a starting pitcher yet again. Do you think uh, you guys will follow through on that plan? We're undecided. I mean, we're tempted because his talent is so good, but we're, we're guarded because of his health issues in the past, and we've na we now know... Uh, he can stay healthy as a reliever, and he can be a good reliever. So uh, he wants to start again, and we're just in uncharted territory uh, we're right now with can he start, can he do it. And, you know, you're, you're just trying to weigh the risk, and he has to be part of the process. Do we take a chance and try to start to stretch him out? He's thrown two innings multiple times last year on rehab, but how does he react to going three, four, five innings and now going every five days? Um, last thing we'd want to do is have him uh, get hurt again and miss all this time after he finally made it back. So we'll, we're open-minded. I think we might take a, a small look in spring training, stretch him out a little bit, uh, but we're not ready to commit to it.